On this page, you can set grid consumption, feed to grid, and others parameters. This switch determines whether the EP900 system is allowed to buy electricity from the grid. Only when you turn it on, can the system draw power from the grid. Next, you have the single phase grid max. Input power setting. It defines the maximum power that each phase of the EP900 system can draw from the grid. You can set this value within a range of 0 to 15,000 watt. While, the supported setting range for single phase grid output current is from 0 to 65 ampere. Unlike the above switch, this switch controls whether the EP900 system can sell electricity to the grid, and the maximum output power and current for the single phase grid are limited to 15,000 watt and 65 ampere, respectively. Moving on to the other page, you'll find the system switch recovery, turn it on, and the Blue Eddy app will record the status of the main system switch before the EP900 shuts down. After restarting the EP900, the Blue Eddy app will automatically restore the main system switch to its previous state. There's the grid self-adaption mode, which is specifically designed to address grid voltage instability issues, such as fluctuations, low voltage, and high voltage. When this mode is activated, the charging power will gradually increase to reduce the impact on the grid while charging from it. 